Hmm. <clears throat> okay, starting off, you're just always going to want to choose a carousel that fits you. I don't really like the whole spatula, because you're just going to be a lot of Ionia players. Choose whatever you want. Don't let don't let peer pressure get to you guys. See? That's a good thing. Alright. Really don't want the spatula opener. Trimo. Okay. 147 is replaced by treasury around. So this is like the dragon from the last set where you're able to re-roll some gold. So maybe you want to have some gold coming into 4-7. Four, uh, four, we know around 4-5, guys, we're going to be level 8 anyways. Okay, we kind of have a Piltover opener here today, so if we find Orianna or any of those little goons, we can go that route here today. This is very exciting. Okay. So we got the squad. We really don't have to think about it anymore. We can just trap Echo in this corner here and just force lose. What a little nice opener to be handed. I mean, if we lose, we're gonna lose infinite. Okay, we found some uh, good components. The big thing, if you guys want to lose streak, is you really don't want to be grabbing any upgrades, right? And you're always going to want to be trapping your unit in the corner. And you're gonna want to have your drag, or not your dragon, but you know what I mean. Your homie up front, your little T-Hex, so he dies. So what's the max cap of this board? So if you guys wanted to go to Team Planner here, we know we're going to want Jinx. We know we're going to want Sejuani. We know we're going to want Gangplank. So strange. Scream. Who else? Who else is a Cannoneer? Rich gets richer here is really good, because we just want to lose anyways, right? We're going to want to go back to trapping Echo in the corner. But I wish it would let you search for, like, gunners. Or, like, we know we want Vi, right? Who else here? Aphelios? Who else? We're one off Jace. Where is Jace? Three cost. That should be about everything. Uh, you know, we already got Echo. And then, you know, it is what it is. We find these units, we find these units. Heimerdonger. You know, any any other things, right? Do we fighting? You know, some little loose streaking goons. You don't want to slam any components here. You really kind of want to open fort. And 3-5 is like a really good interval where you can roll down. And just naturally get where you got to get going. If you guys are able to find... You know, if you're able to make it to where you can kill a few units, you should want to do it. But at least for stage two, I know I want to force the five streak here today. And if we lose horribly, we lose horribly, guys. But I'm going to try to play this as perfectly as I can. I am not a perfect individual. I do not play Piltovers all day, every day. You're going to want to pick up a trash one drop because, oh, you got to be kidding me, bro. Dude, you got to be kidding me here today. Oh my God, are some of these boards just bad, dude? It's so whatever. If we lose, we lose. I mean, if we win, we win. Whatever, my bad. Is what it is. It's okay. Level 3, this person didn't go to level 4, so we take a small loss here. We wanted to pick up a 1 cost here, that way we could have another trait we could put out onto the board. Because naturally you're going to level up here to 4. So we picked up the Aurelia here, where we have just Challenger and Ionia. We don't want to have to put in the Graves where we get Gunner, where we get stronger, right? Hmm.
What to do, what to do. Dover's finest. We we know we know she'll come back to us. Don't focus on keeping that Vi pair. Just focus on getting the gold interest where we can here, right? So what are we looking for here? We already got the health. We're gonna be looking for jinx items here. So we already got a BF sword. So like a bow here would be really good, right? Because we know bow's gonna be universally good. So we're gonna be rich rich. Especially if we lose these next two combats here. And you're gonna wanna lose to about 3-5, five, because 3 five is where we can have that fatty roll down. And we're gonna be uber rich because we got rich gets richer. So we're gonna be looking for a bow. His bow leads into Last Whisper and Giant Slayer here today. We're going to want to take the bow on the 3 cost over the 2 cost. That way we can sell it for more monies. I don't know how big of a T-Hex we'll get here today. Usually 20 is good enough. Yeah, hopefully I don't fight whatever this, like, monstrosity is. I I don't know. If I beat it, I beat it. We might be able to RNG luck out, meaning I'll get a few more losses in before we fight this person just straight griefing. Um. Okay, they actually put units out onto the board now. That's good. I wonder if I saw, I think I saw all of these here. Okay, cool. So we RNG lucked out here. Cause this guy is just hard griefing. And this person's hard griefing. Don't get it. People are trying to force a lost streak and just ruin it for me. So it is what it is. I think next combat I have to sell the, I have to sell the Aurelia. And I have to sell these units on my bench. And they might just full open sell anyways. So it is what it is. Nobody can let you have any fun nowadays, huh? Just losers, dude. Alright, um... Only at nine... Whatever. All we can do is hope that we fight this guy. These two. This is just straight up a griefer. Is what it is. Fucking loser, dude. Yeah, regardless. We knew we were going to fight this guy anyways. I mean, these two are just trying to open grief me. So it is what it is. So we won the RNG here, quite a bit, guys, to be able to fight this person. I mean, loose streaking stage two is the most important like part of this, right, guys? Now, fighting Krugs might be tricky. I'm actually worried about being able to beat Krugs here today. So we actually kind to want to like position for this homie. It actually might not be bad to like level up for this. And actually get like I may be merciful, but Targon And actually get like a item out onto the board here today. We can use Jace as a carry. Probably shouldn't slam components here, but it is what it is. We're probably going to fight the other two griefers coming up here soon. History. Probably shouldn't have slammed the bow. We would have last whisper, but it's whatever. Jace can be a carry or Jinx can be a carry right now. If we fight this guy, we just uber high rolled. Rich gets richer, goes up to 70. 
So we're gonna want to sell. We're gonna want to sell. We're gonna want to hold on to the ashes here. If we can get one more loss, we're, we're looking good. Might be able to get like one more loss. Yeah. Oh no, we'll be able to straight lose all the way till three five. Then we kind of got to go for a little cash out. Okay, but I think we killed a unit. Not sure. Ouch. People are getting pretty strong. 47. It's fine. We really don't want to worry till about like 30 something, right? Gotcha. So this is good. For our homie right here. Where there is evil, I shall go. So we can slam this. So we'll be able to get this for both Jinx. We'll be able to get this for both Jinx and our um Jace here today. We still want to lose here, though. Thirty-six. We'll take another fat loss here, and then we'll be going for the fatty cash out, and hopefully it's good enough to get us where we gotta get going today. No Graves upgrade, there's no bueno here for us. So we got the 20 hacks, and that's all we really cared about. So we gotta start thinking here. Mm. We can level up here. And just pump our gold to where we think we gotta get going, right? We put in the other Jace because we know we're not gonna beat this guy anyways, right? We're really looking for that Aphelios. We're gonna be looking for four gunners coming up here pretty soon. So it's a good item. Giant Slayer here would be good on Jace. Okay, we'll probably get a four cost off the carousel here. None of these are good. Bow here is really good for us here today. If any of these were Aphelios, we'd be in a really good spot. So now we're just gonna roll down every cent we have here today and try to go for a little bit of a cash out. We're going to pump all the way to level 7. And just pray that this is enough. A little nerve-wracking. I'm very slow with this type of stuff, so I don't feel very confident. That's why I did Team Planner here, and hopefully it's enough for us today. I think we can take another loss. We're gonna want to keep rolling here. I 
I think we just won the lobby. I could be wrong. But we're gonna have four gunners here. I don't know what the cash out's gonna be, but hopefully it's fat. Okay, all these are just really bad. That's wonderful. Okay, you are gone. You're out onto the board. Something like this. Really should have kept the, um... So what are we selling here? You're never going onto the board. We can hold these pairs. We should have kept the um, Nyla that we sold, but it's okay. We live and we learn. I think we hold on to whichever pair we hit, and then we sell the other pair after we find it, right? Nyla here was a fantastic find. Water to me. So, we have this Zon, or this Piltover. We really can't change this out until we find the new... We can't until we can find the Heimerdinger, right? Really upset we didn't find the Graves on the roll down. Actually, we can put a Felios out on the board until we need Graves, right? Oh, could we get another Hodge? Oh no, it doesn't look like it. So we know we're gonna need anti heal. And we're gonna want to reforge this. Make a giant slayer on our boy. In the meanwhile, this is just better. Actually, I don't know if that is better or not. But you are for sure gone. We need to go level 8. All these people that try to contest us on the lose streak now are just hard dying, so... This is what it is. We just need this Jinx upgraded, and we really hard stabilize here today. Never this. Never this. Healing orbs is Giga S tier. We can take this now, we can sell these too. Um, we're gonna, we'll just keep it, right? We'll just keep it. I don't, I don't think we ever sell Nyla here on power level, because then we'll just be broke, broke. Some people are starting to become giga strong. We really need that Sejuani. Having a Shen 2 just on bench don't feel good. Wow, healing orbs, orbs didn't cut in there. So this guy's level 7 with a spatula. And our whole board was lined up for him, which was no good. We needed this upgrade. We need this upgrade. We can't take another loss, so we actually have to power level here. That, that's like a giga find. Um. Hmm. Hmm. 
so Tarek here is actually really good. I don't know how we fit Tarek out onto the board, though. I think we're kind of stuck with this until the end of the game. So we need to finish the Aphelios item here today, even though we have no tank items. Um, I just think the bow is good. That way he never has to leave the corner. He's able to just start racking off damage. Although, I think this is like the max max cap. Four gunner. Got the three pilt over. Without Heimerdinger though, right? Scion. Scion Heimerdinger is how you get stronger here. Maybe like Jace three or something. Um, What are we even rolling for? Sejuani. I don't even think we're going to hit that if we roll for it. Something like this. You want to have the Shen, like, your strong side over here, right? The issue is we're too low HP. If we ever take one loss, we just lose. So that's not good. So like multicasters, we can lose too. So we might have to like donkey roll and keep donkey rolling for the Sejuani because I don't think we're ever going for the next tier. And the game's trying to make a good point, man. Maybe we can. If we hit 9 here, it's like the Giga went out. So we might be able to streak here a little bit. But dude, that's so much gold to be able to make it. The only way I see us getting stronger is like getting Sejuani or Scion on onto the board. 2 star. Mm. Wow, all these suck. We really just need a tank item, man. Bramble... Okay, come on, said you want it one time for the one time. Bramble, come on, dude, one time for the one time. Actually, not gonna complain. Can we find another Vi? Yeah, we wanted to be able to get that refresh in there. We need the Vi, guys, so we can transfer the Sunfire. We're really looking for a triple, um... We're really just looking for the triple Meccano. I wonder what's better to put on onto the board here, the Scion? Or the Shen 2? Shen 2 is just a beefcake, man. So, it's kind of hard to say. Everybody's living with nothing. So we got the three Pilty.
Um. Wow, this is tough. I just don't want J4 to like be able to wombo the whole board over and over. Oh, there's the Vi. Is this 15? It's not 15. I don't know if her beat and whatever the hell that is. Okay, turns out, turns out, Giant Slayer and Radiant like. Oh God. Can we win this today, boys? The cash out tuber, bro. Um, we just need we just need the Sejuani item. We just need that Sejuani item. I don't know how we're gonna be doing this today, but let's be hoping. I think we beat. I just don't know how we get through this. I don't know why that thing's so giga thick. I think we beat all these. It really depends how Fiora jumps. We're fighting this, or we're fighting this. Turns out all we need to do is just stack all of our damage up onto one side so we can proc the healing orbs and get the new boot goofing. Alright. Heimerdinger. One time for the one time? Oh, bro. You gotta be hitting me with the, the double legendary combo, bro. Um. I think it's fine to position like this still. I mean, we have Radiant Last Whisper. If that can't get through this Nasus, I don't, I don't know what is, dude. Wow. Guess a double Radiant item on Azir. I I guess I had to move my team and have it hit the weaker units and just be able to delete the, the bad units first. But then the issue is is my team walks forward and then it gets deleted by Azir and Nasus never dies. Feels bad about this rock, paper, scissors match, because I beat this guy and this guy. I just I guess I don't beat this. I don't know. This this board looks so bad.
Maybe I should have went nine. Could have probably went nine. This guy's got a ton of thieves gloves, though. I think this person wins depending on how this Velveth rolls the items. I was such- I also feel my cash out for my T-Hex was very bad this game. What did I get? I think I got like two components and like some gold. I feel like to play that like unless you're playing in like real low elo or you get that Piltover opener and you have like um trans- not transfusion but like the one where it's you heal two HP every combat like the one person had here. Yeah this one. Metabolic Accelerator. Unless you have that, I don't know how you get those 40 or 50. Or maybe, what is it? Um, The Titan's Health or whatever it is. Unless you get those, I don't know how you get those 40 or like 50 stack T-Hexes in these high elo lobbies without just dying. Because I had two people trying to grief my lose streak this game too. Or maybe I think I overruled too. That might have been something. I had good itemization though, I just had no tank items till the very end as well. Makes no sense to me why this person isn't getting like value out of unified resistances for like multiple of their units. Missing out on value on like three or four units right now that could still be a live casting abilities. I thought I think it'll matter now, but like I don't know. Something small that might be making a difference in these fights. Yeah, see. So they have unified resistance, and only these three and these three are getting value from it. So a target dummy, two carries, and two, like, these two units should just. Or these two units should be up a hex, or have these two start back a hex, or have, like, this up one. I don't know if he's, like, trying to get, get the most of, like, the Baron knockup or something. Makes no sense to me. And if that's the case, I mean, just have them all up. Like, Cassidin and, Ren like, Rek'Sai, they're just meat, like, sponges. Yeah, see, now we're getting value out of it. I don't know if it'll make a difference, but... Might be the chip damage that you need for, like, Belva to actually kill something. Yeah, see? Big difference. Also, I think Belveth actually rolled the damage item, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. A um, little bit of a commentation of the game. I was hoping for more, but is what it is. Hopefully, you guys have a good day.